Welcome back to another Trucker Tim video where you find me down at the airfield with trucking sounds. Ant has kindly offered to come down and fit air horns on the Trucker Tim Experience Days Volvo FH. Beaver bus. Oh. Well, this is. You absolute. What are we actually going to do now? Wood glue? Flipping out, Ant. It uh, literally is not my fault. They were right until you picked them up. I picked them up and they... they yes. Yeah. Are these available in my merch store, Ant? Um, can be. They can be. I've got these ones now coming to the merch store. I right, put that glue down. I like that, don't you? Do you stay in the night? I see you've got your bed. <laughs> no, I'm going to go home. You're then. going home. Yeah. Well, I'm not. I'm staying in the uh, in the Volvo tonight, doing a bit of camping. Is it? I'm camping. Does the heat work? I've tried it. I'm going to go where it doesn't. I hope it does. Are they going to be all right now? If we mount them like that, we can't mount them like that. I mean. Well, yeah, they're all right. You might need to order another pair. Yeah, maybe, mate. I've got some more at home, actually. Must have picked the, the wrong pair up. Yeah. Well, that looks safe on there as well, mate, isn't it, really? Yeah, so tonight I'm spending the night in the truck and we're doing a little bit of truck camping, apparently, Ant. This airfield's haunted. You, uh, yeah. The Sturgate ghost. <coughs> apparently that is true, so it's going to be a bit spooky tonight on my own. Beaver bus. Do you like beaver ant? Just need some air. We're away then. That's all it is, yeah. Oh, you've just unwired it. Carry on camping. A spatula. Because you need a spatula when you go camping, ant. Yeah. Have you got a spatula, yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah. And what are you doing? I'm putting it in here. No, you're not. You just lined up the holes. Yeah. If I bought. <gasps> you knocked it off again. <laughs> in the box at home. I didn't bring the box, but there is a template. Little, course, yeah, you, mm. but you didn't little, bring that. No, a little rubber template. Right. There's actually, I didn't bring that, no. Didn't think we'd need that. That's where I put them on uh, GL12 when I worked at Dates for isn't there? there did you? Yeah, I did. Yeah, me, yeah. And jo me and Josh, actually. Oh, yeah. yeah. Why is he not here doing this? Yeah. Why am I here on a Saturday afternoon? Because you offered. I need some grease on my fifth wheel. Look at that, Ant. Yeah. Yeah. This chassis is on here is better than the R series. With the air horns, is it fault? No. I thought you'd have some. You have, look. Have you got nuts though? Yeah. Good job you've got all I've the got gear. Big nuts. Sorry, mate, I'll get out of your way, yeah? yeah sure. Oh, I'm going to put a trucking sound sticker on the truck. I'm always happy. Yeah. I'll go out there, will yeah, Well, what? I'm trying to stick my sticker on. I'll back, I'll back up it up there. Oh, you're using a different word to start with C then. Clown. No. Can I stop? No, nope, say that. Oh. Look at that. Oof. Are you holding that down? No. Oh. Do you want me to? Go on, hold a camera and hold this in here. Coming through, Ant. Ah! We're in, boy. Get a nut on that. I need to put another hole through for the air pipe, don't forget. Oh, cheers for that. I, you know, I wouldn't have done it. What's happening there? <laughs> You're getting in the way. Standard. Can I let go of these now? Yeah. <gasps> oh, a bit more. Go on. Go on. Keep stopping. Flat. Battery's flat on that. It's not, it's just your... Ryo, you. Ryobi! You are incompetent. I'm just going to show him your new light bars you've had installed. Yeah? From LA know. Light Bars. Shout out. Is it LA? LA. La Light it Bars. it was La Light Bars. La 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 Bars. Could have washed your van. You knew he was going to be on camera today. Do you like the Beaver bus? Look at this plane, just chilling. Ant nearly clobbered that wing when he pulled in. Has he been to Truck Max? Has it been to Truck Max? I see your exhaust poking down the side there. That's standard. That's standard, is it? We should start a new company, Van Max. Got his horns on the roof. We'll give them a couple of blasts in a minute and we'll see what it looks like when it gets dark because no doubt you'll still be here when it's dark. I think I might be. Conduit. What are you bothering with that for? Conduit. 
When Josh did your truck, did he not use conduit? No. So, and that is a proper working truck. Yeah. But we'll do it because I mean, you're a professional. I've got nothing else to say on the matter. Okay, mate. I think that's enough. <laughs> Watch your head. <gasps> I've got bunk beds, Ant. Do you want to stay? Take that as a no. Need someone to hold me hand. It's going to be scary on here tonight. It's really haunted, apparently. The Sturgate Ghost. It's, what's the name? Amelia Earhart, I told you. Who even is that? It's a lovely evening. Should we go pub? It's a bit cold. There's a pub up the road. Did you see it on your way in? Rose and Crown. No. There's the trailer over there, aren't I don't really drink, to be honest. You don't drink! <laughs> Are them horns going to be all right? I think one lap of the airfield and they're going to be off. Oh. How's it going, mate? All right. What's one of doing this? Oh, boy, there. Oh, is this it? <gasps> Yeah, that's loud. Thank you. What I'm doing is I'll, I'll do some more research and I'll give you a call back, okay? Yeah, no problem. Thank you, mate. All right. Cheers, cheers mate. mate. Probably heard all that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm going to stick a trucking sound sticker on the beaver bus. Catch the trucking sounds. It's going to be spooky tonight. Oh. Oh. So just putting it back together then mate, yeah? Yeah. And then we're done. Good. And I can get set up in my cab. Yep. Ready for your cold night out. I hope it works. <laughs> Nip in the air now. It, is. it was alright earlier. It got very cold all of a sudden. You want me to leave my van here so you can stay in that? That's quite a nice. Yeah. How are you getting home, man? Take the cougar. The yard wouldn't be seen dead, isn't it? Joe's daughter's just seen Ed, four car, yeah. in next, shopping oh. with his with um with his missus. Ah. Cheers, mate. Look at this ant. Not that, mate. You like that, don't you? Look, and this one. Got your name all over it, this truck. Romo. Yeah. 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 Come on, let's get it done then, because oh, I'm hungry. Sorry. I want to get my, get my soup on. Oh, what are we having? Are we having lunch? Soup. What are you going to cook it on? A, a stove. A stove? Yeah. What is this, the 90s? Come on. Have you got two sticks and some kindling? Yeah. As if you're I'm camping! Me. As if you're trying to rush me. I want to go to bed. Some half of... four? What's the time? <laughs> Some of us had a long day. Not even half four. <laughs> you absolute. Ah. That fripped the life out of me. Please tell me you were filming. I was. To be honest, I didn't even know you were there. I didn't look around. You did. I didn't. That's why you did it. No, I didn't. Why did you do it then? See if it still works. Yeah. Make sure I can go through a pipe before. Mm. Let's put them in there like that. Thank you, Ant. <laughs> Let's see your lights then. Oh, yeah. What? Yeah. That's an airplane, that, mate. That's yeah, what that is. Watch that on the way yeah, don't clip that. Whoa! I need to change these bulbs. LED, yeah. LED bulbs in there, mate. Have a look. The flash it. <sighs> They're good. You need a beefy flap. I know, I've got the metal bracket on it, ready for it. Have you? What are you going to have on it? Trucking sounds, probably. Might get mobile audio in. Mobile audio. Well, thanks for that, Ant. No problem, mate. Nice Thank to you. see you. Hopefully, I'll survive the night in yeah. this. Uh, it's going to get windy later. Anything could happen tonight, but I'll let you. I'll let you go. I'm now here on the haunted Sturgate airfield all by myself. I've... Some strange noises. The airplane over here. Has to be said, I'm not, I'm not really enjoying this. <gasps> oh my God. Here's the beaver bus. Oh my God, how creepy does this look? Oh my God. Here is the Trucker Tim Experiences truck, my hotel for this evening. What is that noise? Oh my God. Just hear this mark on the tank is when one of the participants today caught a tire on the circuit. I've obviously got the tones fitted now. Check them out. Cheers, Ant. I do my vehicle checks before I go to bed. 
Do we have any marks down this side? No. Anyway, let's get in the Volvo and start our night's camping. Before we get in, I'll show you what I've got in here. <gasps> I got the torch. So in here, open up this side locker. I have my water, toothbrush, toothpaste, and some deodorant. Lovely. So I can freshen up from that. This should just go, with it being magnetic, on there. There we go. This is our washing facilities. I'll shut that up for now. Let me just turn up my camping lantern. There we go. In the Volvo, we've got the option of sleeping on the bottom bunk or the top bunk. I have obviously chosen top bunk. Bin here, we've got the stove set up, ready, because I'm going to have some tea in a minute. I think I'm going to have some soup. I'm going to have soup tonight. I've got my kitchen roll up there and my tray to eat my food off. A nice camping lantern, so I can move that around to wherever I want it to provide light. Uh, this ratchet strap, I'll show you what I'm going to use this for later on in the video. But for now, that can sit up there on the dashboard. I've got my phone on charge here, and I've also got my GoPro batteries on charge down there. Slippers. Gonna get those on in a minute. Just gonna chill out, make myself some tea, probably read a book. I've got a book to read up there. Yeah, just enjoy my evening, really. In here, I'll just move my bin up onto there. And as well, with sleeping up on the top bunk, I'll show you the bed in a second. Um, you can use this area to put stuff. Let's just open up this. In here, we have everything we need for camping. Got our saucepan there, frying pan, cup. Um, got eggs, my soup. What's that noise? I've uh, got some butter there, some bread, bits and bobs, cutlery, this as well for the stove so I can make some toast in the morning. We're going to have toast in the morning when we get up. Uh, yeah, and some fairy liquids. I'm doing my washing up with my water that you just see in the side locker. Just to shut that up for the time being. I can sit in there like that. It's got them off. Here is my bed. This is where I'm sleeping tonight. Noises, man. Keep hearing noises. Anyway, another reason for me choosing top bunk to bottom bunk is if you look at top bunk, it seems a little bit wider, so I've got more room when I'm sleeping. If you look at that one and then look at this one, look, you can see it's a lot bigger. I've got my pajamas here, so let's get into them and then we'll start making tea. Hold up before we do that. We really need to put the curtains round, just in case there is anybody lurking round. Let's put the curtains round. Make sure the door's locked. Put this up. Move the tray. All right, next one. Oh my God, there's not much room in these cabs. Push that forward, lock that. Put this curtain round. We're camping. So I'm now in my pajamas. Check me out. And my slippers. Ooh. I'll sit here in the driver's seat. And just show you around now the curtains are shut. So how cozy is this? So I've also got my bed up there and my book ready to go. Looks very comfy and inviting up there. Cannot wait to get in there. I've also got the curtains shut, got the stove there ready to cook my tea and my tray. There's my bin down there ready to go. Curtains are all shut. Love it. So what we'll do guys, I think, we start making tea. Ah, night heater. We haven't tried the night heater. Oh, I hope it works because there's a bit of a nip in there. I haven't even tried it to be honest. I just assumed it'll work. So let's see. Oh, oh, we've got a light. That is a good sign. That is a good sign. So now we just have to listen for the whirring to start. What I need in here really is a nice, uh, a nice plush mat to go in the middle for my evenings camping. Love a bit of truck camping. Anyway, let's start cooking. Mrs. Trucker Tim will be so impressed with me. So I've got my mug there for my tea later on. I'm gonna need that. And here's my soup. Heinz tomato soup. The bowl. Oh, hang on, thinking about it. Do I need a bowl? I'll eat it out of the saucepan. I'll eat it out of the saucepan. Save washing up. And I'm gonna need a spoon. A spoon. And obviously, I will have some bread to dip into my soup. This bed actually pushes up. You'll see what I mean. Pull these. All right, this should push up like this. Right up, like that. Yeah, let's put that bed up out the way until we want to get in it. And now, look how much more room I've got to sit on the bed. Oh. Oh, 
we're on. Soup is on! Oh god, that's hot. It's right down on minimum as well. Well, isn't this cosy? Look at this. It's just bubbling. Turn it off for a second. Wow. Some heat in that soup. Ah. I've just realised the night heater isn't purring. It's not making any noise whatsoever. So I'd say the night heater doesn't work. Man. It's gonna be one cold night. No night heater. I say it's been switched on now for about 20 minutes and I've just realized I haven't heard it whirring. <sighs> Flipping hell. Anyway, let's get some warm food inside us. Hopefully I'll keep us warm overnight <laughs> or not. I'll put that up on here on my tray. Do that. Ah, tea time. I can't believe the night heat is not working. <sighs> Let's try it out, see if it's warm. I dropped my bread in the soup. Ah, no! It's sinking. It's gone. Scoop that out with a, with a spoon in a minute. Oh my God. It's been so long since I've had a uh, tomato soup. I think it's warm enough. I can have my soup, then we'll wash up. And I'll probably uh, brush my teeth, have a little wash outside, and uh, go to bed. Read my book and try and get a good night's sleep. Well, we need to do some extra security measures as well before we go to sleep. Apparently, it's only about six o'clock now, but at about 10, 11 o'clock tonight, it's going to get very, very windy here on the airfield. <laughs> so that'll probably wake us up in the night. I'd love tomato soup. Mm -hmm. So get in the comments and let me know what your favourite soup is. Oh, got a message. Sure, maze. Keep hearing noises outside. Mm. This is good. I'm enjoying this. Doing the job. It's hitting the spot. It's a perfect little spot here. See, now I'm not sitting on my bed while I eat my food because my bed is up there. That's the point. There's no ladder. It's going to be interesting. I'm going to try and get up there. Anyway, while you sit there watching me eat soup in a cab, please, if you're enjoying this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment because I read all your comments as well. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Turn on the bell notifications. We've got so much stuff coming this year. So much stuff. It's going to be crazy year. Right, that will do me. Is that still warm? Oh, that's cooled down. Then. Right, let's go and wash up. Oh, we're all steamed up. Go wash up. Do, 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 do. Just hit me head. Mrs. Trucker Tim would be proud of me. Hope you're watching, dear. Camping on an airfield, guys. Absolutely loving it. Put them back in the cab. What I'll probably do now, guys, while I'm outside, I might as well brush my teeth, so. Before bed. Brushing my teeth on the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that getting cold out here? Nice. The state of me! I'm going to use a tea towel. I haven't got any other towel. I'll tell you what, that water's cold. There we go. That in there ready for the morning. Shut up the kitchen. I suppose we're hopping and uh, get ready for bed. Freezing. I'll put that in 
there. Like that. Shut the door. Let's bring this down. Like that. Down comes my bed. There you go. There's my bed. Just put that down. And my bed is there now, ready to slide into. And we've got these extra curtains as well to go around the bed, which makes it extra, extra cosy. We're in our pyjamas. We don't have a night here. It's still on, but there literally isn't anything, as you can hear. So we might as well turn that off. We'll climb up into bed. This could be interesting. Reading light up here, look. And my book. Uh, uh, if I do this, I'm going to be the wrong way around. Oh, I'm up. Ooh. Hello. Hello. I'm up on here. I'm in. I'm in my bed. This is all right, this. I'll tell you what, guys, this is actually really, really comfy up here. I'll just kick my slippers off. There we go. Look at me. Grab my light. So from up here on top bunk, this is my view down. So obviously you've got the driver's seat there. Quite high up, actually. Oh, that'll go on there. Oh, that sits on there nicely. Hmm. I didn't do the security measures. Oh, my lantern! So as you see, I was reading my book and then I got scared because I heard noises while I was reading my scary book. And I remembered I didn't do the big security measure to help with people getting in the cab and trying to murder me. That is why I bought this strap. You'll see what I'm about to do with this. Just little tips, you know, if you're out on the road, put this around this door handle here and pull it tight. And then what I was to do, go around this door handle once, like that, pull it through. And then I'll do the ratchet up, not too tight. And that is now pulling that door and that door in together so they can't open the door. Even if they break the lock and want to open the door, they can't because these doors are tied together. So. Let me get back in bed. And then... <laughs> Keep getting on, but I'm the wrong way around. <laughs> I've left my lantern down there. Oh no. Uh, uh, yes. Oh, I think I'm gonna need a jumper on tonight. Oh, I've still got a t-shirt on, because obviously I'm moving around and keeping warm, but once I get still, I think I'm gonna have to get a jumper on. I've got a jumper up in one of these top lockers here. Obviously now you can see, put my strap across and that's holding those two doors together. So their only way in now is through the window. If they smash that, I'll be pretty aware of it. So, and then I'll hit them over the head with my lantern. Oh, you are kidding me. How do you turn these lights off? Oh, it's that button down there. Do it with your foot. There we go. Cab lights are off. Oh, I'm getting to bed. Don't know if I want to read my book. <sighs> I'm in bed. Not sure I should really be reading this where I am right now, in a truck, on a haunted airfield, on my own. Yeah, I have tied my doors together, so we should be safe. Now, obviously, we're on the bed. We can, if we want to, pull this curtain, like this, and this one here, like this. I'll tell you what, sleeping in a truck is literally like camping. So when these lorry drivers are out all week, or two or three nights a week or whatever, they're literally gone away from home camping and they're just like traveling around stopping and camping it's cool it's cool it's definitely a way of life you know you gotta get used to it and have your stuff all organized and everything like that but it's doable and it's quite enjoyable it's scary when you're out in the middle of nowhere like i am though and probably not so nice as well when you're like me and your night heater doesn't work and it's january yeah it's a little bit like a coffin but it's, it's comfortable Ooh, wrap up warm and my lantern off See you in the morning, guys. Wish me luck.